The future rap is me. Me, me, and me. Gucci gang, Gucci gang, Gucci gang. Only one name comes to mind when you hear these lyrics. Lil Pump is one of the few rappers who are able to mark their territory with a single entry into the music world. With his first single, he rose to fame as the song reached number three on the U.S. Billboard Hot 100 and was certified platinum three times. But this is common knowledge. Today we're talking about eight things you never knew about Lil Pump. Make sure to stick around until the end because you don't want to miss out on hearing some of these shocking facts. Also, make sure to leave a like on this video if you're a fan of Lil Pump. And if you would like to join this month's giveaway of your choice between a brand new iPhone 12 or the new PlayStation 5, then all you have to do is subscribe to the channel and watch this video until the end to find and comment the hidden message. Good luck! Number 8. He's the only American in his family. When Lil Pump first hit the rap scene and blew up on SoundCloud, he wasn't all about revealing details about his life. We had a young rapper who was already drawing in more dollars than a lot of people had seen at that age, and all these before he was considered old enough to drive. But we were all curious, who's the new kid? Google registered a lot of searches. People were asking questions about him. It wasn't long before the world got to know who he really was, despite how tight-lipped he had been about his personal life. One night, his backpack allegedly got stolen, and a video made its way online. In this video, we could see the first page of his passport, which had the name Gazi Garcia. The passport revealed that he was born in August 2000, which means he is just 20 years old right now. His name also correctly suggested that he is Latino, and this was confirmed when he revealed that his parents were Colombian immigrants. The twist here is that he has an older brother who was born in Cambodia while Lil Pump was born in the city of Miami, making him the only American in his family. Who even knew he had an older brother? Number 7. Never wanted to become a rapper Can you imagine a world without Lil Pump hits? Well, it's crazy to think that we were that close to having one as Lil Pump never wanted to become a rapper in the first place. It's all thanks to Smoke Perp, who was tight buds with the young rapper. The two met when Lil Pump was just 13 years old. At the time, the American rapper was writing his own music and seeking solace in those lyrics. They formed a tight bond over dumb stuff like how much they were able to smoke and break windows. So basically, they were attracted to each other's criminal tendencies. And it's quite possible that the young rapper's troubled childhood contributed a lot to this. He was a troubled child on the lookout for mischief, especially after his parents separated when he was just six years old. And get this, it happened over Christmas. We can only imagine how awful that would have felt and how every holiday after that would be pure torture. Anyway, Lil Pump and Smoke Burp were so close that the producer saw something in the young rapper that he didn't see in himself, talent. He tried hard to convince Lil Pump to record some songs, but he always refused. Finally, Smoke Burp dragged him to the studio where he made him freestyle over a beat. And that was it. This freestyle would later become the song that made Lil Pump popular on SoundCloud. And before you know it, he started getting on tours. Talk about making the right choices. Number 6. He fought a fan during his tour. Well, we can't really call this person a fan because a fan wouldn't use curse words on his favorite superstar. But that's exactly what this dude did. It's a big deal to go on tour organized by No Jumper, and that's what Lil Pump did in March 2017. While most of the shows were sold out, it didn't go exactly as planned. While Lil Pump was performing on stage, someone screamed, F Lil Pump. Most times, artists on stage would ignore such obvious attention-seeking and either continue with the show or say something about how it's not cool to be mean. But not Lil Pump. He wanted to know who yelled the curse word, and a guy replied. No one knows if this was the guy that yelled the word or if he was just trying to get on the action like some show-off moment, but he caught some hands. Lil Pump jumped into the ground and wrestled him for a while before they were pulled apart. Apparently, the guy doesn't joke around with bullies. Now, before we continue our list, we wanted to add a bonus fact that relates to Lil Pump's recent actions involving Donald Trump. As many of you have now seen, Pump has been publicly showing his support to President Trump and was even brought on stage to speak during a Trump rally. Even though Trump accidentally called him Lil Pimp, that's still a pretty cool thing to be able to do. But did you know that Lil Pump never registered to vote? So despite the very public support, he never even voted. Thought that was interesting enough to earn a bonus spot on this list. Now, let's continue with number 5, Not a Harvard Dropout. Lil Pump released an album he titled Harvard Dropout, and that sparked some rumors. A lot of people believed that he had actually attended Harvard and dropped out to pursue music. This is not totally impossible as we have some legends who have done it, but Lil Pump is not one of them. We know from his background that there is no way he would have been able to afford it, and that's even if he went to high school, which he didn't. Lil Pump may have tweeted that he really did drop off Harvard to save the rap game, but that's not true. He couldn't graduate from high school because he got kicked out of every single public school he enrolled in. 
And when I say kicked out, I really mean just sent packing, because he was too much trouble. He got expelled in 10th grade for getting into a fight with a girl, and that got him into Opportunity High School. Now, for those who have no idea what an Opportunity High School is, it's when you get into crossbreed prison and a high school. It had everything from pat-downs to metal detectors. But this bad boy still managed to start a riot with dogs, helicopters, and everything. Despite his troubled childhood, Lil Pump still has a huge net worth at 20 years old, enough to blow on expensive cars and shopping sprees at Gucci stores. What were you doing at 20? Number 4. Gets kicked off social media a lot Lil Pump has a thing for getting in the wrong side of social media platforms, including Twitter, Instagram, and SoundCloud. And the fact that it happens multiple times means that the young rapper just doesn't learn from his mistakes. The first time he got kicked off Twitter, he had posted lewd photos with girls where his hands were a little busy. The tweet should have never left his drafts. Unfortunately, it did, and he got kicked out for that. When he got back, Lil Pump gave some time before he was once again on the Jack's wrong side. This time, it was a machine gun in his mouth. Now, it looks like it's all fun and games until the heads are rolling off. But that's not the worst of his social media experience, as he has had three songs removed from his SoundCloud. Considering that one of them has gotten more than 4 million plays, and this was the platform that got him into the limelight, this would have been very disappointing for him. Number 3. He Hates J. Cole Why do we think he hates J. Cole? Well, we don't think, we know. Lil Pump posted a video online, and all he said was F. J. Cole. He even had a diss track where that was all he said for almost a minute of the track. But what's his beef with J. Cole? Lil Pump thinks that the music star is too lyrical and ugly. But really, the same J. Cole, or is there another one out there? We know that J. Cole is definitely not ugly, which makes us believe that this was Lil Pump trolling for some publicity. Except, he really does hate the guy, and doesn't want to reveal the real reasons. Number 2. Always on the wrong side of the law Lil Pump has a long relationship with law enforcement, starting from his rebellious childhood. But as an 18-year-old teen, he still has had a lot of beef with the law. In February 2018, the young rapper was being held responsible for a gunfire exchange at his house. Later, they discovered that his mother had kept the firearm unsecured, and she was charged for endangering a minor. Looks like breaking the rules runs in the family. Lil Pump wasn't implicated that one time, but that didn't stop him from being the subject of drug possession charges in December that same year. Just as he was about to take off on a flight at the Miami airport, a security guard tried to search his luggage for cannabis. Lil Pump insisted that he had nothing on him, and that got him into trouble as he ended up disrespecting a police officer. This got him a two-year banishment from the state of Denmark. Number 1. Crush on Miranda Cosgrove Although we have no news of Lil Pump having a girlfriend or being in a relationship currently, it's no secret that he has a massive crush on Miranda Cosgrove. Remember the main character in iCarly? Yes, that Miranda. The crush had started when he was 18 years old, and maybe he has grown out of it now. But it's only been two years. When he was 18, he was pretty loud with his intentions to be with the college star, which is actually seven years older than him. Eventually, she went on a date with him after her fans begged her to give Lil Pump a chance. But it was not to be, as these two only remained friends for a while. And that brings us to the end of today's list. Which of these facts did you find the most interesting? Are there any others that you think deserve a spot on this list? Let us know your thoughts in the comments section down below. Also, don't forget to leave a like on this video if you're a big fan of Lil Pump. And if you're new to this channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button for all future content. Thanks for watching. Until next time.